I think that's what I learned the most is, you know, you can sort of imagine how much someone must bond with an animal like that. But to then talk to someone who's, um, you know, has that, has that dog as part of their lives day in and day out. And, um, you know, I think that was the biggest learning experience for me. Yeah. This has brought more awareness to people with vision impairment. And now we can kind of go, oh yeah, that person has visual impairment, so, but they've still got this freedom with the guide dog. When we met with our client, I think we were all just struck by how courageous and how confident she was, even without her sight. I mean, uh, we, we don't know what it's like to live without sight. It made me think, you know, in order to come up with a concept that was suitable for the dog, uh, I kind of thought about the role of the dog which was kind of like taking people around the suburbs and giving them the freedom to be kind of somewhat free. And so that was kind of something that I thought about. Often we see people for just what they are or what disability they have, but actually they've got a whole personality, they've got all different types of hobbies they like to do. So it was really important for us to, um, to know that. When we met with Margaret, she told us all about like what happens when the do guide dog, is, like when she is like calling for the guide dog, the guide dog will come to her and like sort of like sit with her to make sure she's okay. Initially I've gone with the idea of a bird and that sense of freedom that the guide dogs provide. And um, from there I developed it further into uh, sort of an owl and that uh, sense of wisdom that they're able to provide. I've been an artist for a long time. I've done the dog, it's colourful and I like doing it and it's fun to do it and I'm just so happy to done, that I've done it. Rory having lost his sight as an adult and then having to re learn how to operate in the world without sight. I'm just totally in awe of his um, um, ability to be able to do that. You know, they help their owners every single day and they, you know, make their life a lot easier. You know, without the guide dogs, they, you know, pretty much wouldn't be able to go out in public or do a lot of things around the house. So we just learnt a lot more about what the dog does and how important they really are.